All right, so here we are at Barton Creek and we're about to go in the Barton Creek Cave. Here in Belize, it's a cave that the Mayans used to use for sacrifices and they actually used to take mushrooms and go in the cave and have rituals and all sorts of cool stuff. So we're gonna go check it out. We're out of Captain Jack's zip line right now, and we've just done one zip line. We've got another one of our group coming in right behind me. Yeah. Pretty fun. Zip line into the jungle. So we just got back to our room. Awesome day today, first day in Belize. We started the day off with a tour of the Barton Cave, which is a cave that the Mayans actually used to, uh, they used to take mushrooms and do human sacrifices inside of. Uh, we got to see a real life human skull, uh, some ancient vases that are over, um, I guess over 5,000 years old now is what they said, 3,000 BC. So over 5,000 years old, that's pretty wild. I uh, got to go through the cave, got some cool footage there. Uh, and then after that, we went zip lining. Zip lining is, is always super fun through the jungle. It was hot and humid, uh, but a lot of fun out there. We actually met a couple who are kind of here on the same dates as us, uh, visiting from the UK. So we pretty much did everything with them today. It was a lot of fun. And I think when we go over to Matachica Resort, uh, they're kind of going over at the same time as well. So we'll probably be seeing them throughout the trip. Uh, but I think we're going to head back down to the river now. Uh, there's a waterfall down there. Uh, it's called the Five Sisters Waterfall. And there's a little beach down there. We're going to go hang out, chill, have some cocktails, and see where the night takes us. <laughs> All right. Day number two in Belize. We're here at Rio Frio Cave. We've got a few adventures planned today. I think three adventures. Uh, we're gonna head in this cave right now and then we're on our way to Caracol, which is the largest uh, Mayan ruin here in Belize. It's the highest point, highest man-made um, structure in Central America. Hopefully gonna learn some more facts about it once we get up there, over there. Go check out this cave and Kenzie's gonna get bit by bugs. I am, all of them. <laughs>
lived. This is a tomb they just kept buried. They found a Mayan princess in there. Over there is a tomb. And right there is a tomb. Now we go up. We just finished up our tour here at Caracol. Never been to a Mayan ruin before, really any kind of Central American ruins. Uh, it's super cool. Apparently this place is, is much bigger than uh, what they've uncovered. I think they said it's like 100 or 200 square kilometers uh, that they found with LIDAR. And they've only uncovered like one one hundredth of it. So, uh, super cool. I think the plans are to uncover more as it gets more popular and they can make um, They need to make more money to um, To be able to afford to have the um, the archaeological excavation. Yeah, awesome day here uh, If you ever come to Belize highly recommend checking out Caracol and if you come with Gaia Their guides are super informative. I learned a ton today It was really interesting to learn all about the Mayans and how they lived and Kind of what happened to their society. It's a Yucatec word, meaning avocado. So we're out at the Rio on Pools, which translates to River Avocado Pools. There used to be some avocado trees around here. When uh, the explorers found this area, that's what they made, it, made them think of. Alright, so we just got back from our day trip from the lodge and we decided to take on this local hike uh, to a waterfall. It might be the coolest thing that we've done so far. I'm looking at it right now. Put my camera, get a little better view. We just wrapped up the day today and what a day it was. We started off at 8 a.m. We saw those caves, then we went to Caracol. 150 square kilometers of Mayan ruins. Um, I think they said like one one hundredth of it has been uncovered. There's so much more to actually be dug up. Um, that was so cool. I've never been to 
ancient Mayan ruins before and learned a lot today, learned a lot about their civilization and their history. And I was glad to have the tour guide there. They were super informative and super helpful, uh, letting us, or giving us a tour around, showing us the place, places to go, things to check out there. Um, I got a ton of footage and that was just quite the experience. The Mayans, uh, as far as culturally goes, are more unique than any culture I've ever experienced. Then we headed to the Rio on pools. That was super fun, just nice to cool off in those pools, got a little swim in. And then once we got back, we had, headed to this waterfall right by the resort, um, Big Rock Waterfall. And I think that's the coolest thing that we've done so far. That was, that was so awesome. The local dog who stays at the resort uh, went with us. She was kind of our tour guide. She's still with us now, uh, just up ahead, uh, out there with Kenzie. All right, so we just finished up our last last breakfast here here at Gaia Resort. Incredible view right here from this table. I think we've sat at almost every time. We've got the river down below, mountain view behind us. Super cool resort. If you ever come to Belize, definitely recommend coming and checking out Gaia. It's deep in the jungle uh, so everything that comes with that from the bugs to the lizards to the big spiders and snakes I think we've seen it all uh, but it just adds to the the charm of, of being out in the jungle uh, it really feels like after seeing all the Mayan ruins and Mayan history here um, it's such a deep part of the culture food uh, it's very very awesome but we're about to head to Matachica Resort we're gonna head back to Belize City now it's about a two-hour drive and then we're gonna take a, uh, a puddle hopper, puddle jumper, uh, small airplane over to Matachica. And then that's in Ambergris Key. And spend the rest of our trip here uh, on an island, on the ocean. Uh, we have a, a cool accommodation there. Excited to go check it out. Excited to get some more sun and get in the ocean. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. See you in the next video soon. Peace.